Hey guys, welcome to OMG Daily. We have some interesting stories for you guys. Uh, we're starting off with GCB Bank. Okay. Yes. So the Bank of Ghana has given GCB uh, GCB Bank Limited the green light to acquire two local banks, UT and Capital Bank. Mm -hmm. A statement from the central bank and copy to City Business News said, the Bank of Ghana has approved a purchase and assumption transaction with GCB Bank Limited yep. that transfers all deposits and selected assets of UT Bank Limited and Capital Bank Limited to GC Bank Limited. Mm -hmm. Wow. So, <laughs> I mean, waking up this morning and hearing the news all over, I first chanced on it on Facebook. Ah, That's okay. why I first saw the story okay. and I didn't really know. And then I went on my WhatsApp platforms and everybody was just talking on. about it. We're going crazy. People are going just crazy. Just imagine waking up, going to work, mm -hmm. you get there, the doors are locked. Yes, um, I mean, there were even pictures on yeah. Facebook mm -hmm. showing, you know, GTB, uh, no, UT stuff. Yes. You know, I think they were stuck outside and yep, the doors, outside. doors were locked. In. It's, it's madness. crazy. It's crazy. Uh, well, hopefully everyone's money is okay. <laughs> I hope so. But yeah. well, because I mean, um, GCB has already sent out messages to you know these customers mm. of um, UT and Capital Bank that uh, yes. your monies are safe with mm -hmm. us, mm -hmm. so no panic. Don't you just about go about it. your daily banking, you know whatever mm -hmm. that you do. Just calm down, calm down. We are in control. Yes. So, <laughs> and I think I think that's really good of GCB. I mean, yeah. I mean their communication um, department or whatever is very mm -hmm. well. It you know, has to be because. Well. Imagine just waking up and hearing the news. Like it's not like anyone was prepped for this. You wake up to hear, oh, you're out of a job, mm -hmm. or your bank is now being changed exactly. from UT to GCB. It's like what? Wow. And you know, yes, sir, mo. GT four, and a capital bank for yes, sir, munya butre. Na if I say Ghana Commercial Bank for mu kramu trick, almost mu kramu. Musi kani aje ni na e wohoni ni na e daso guho. Timu kosoa na as time goes on, mu bete dia. Okay, so let's move on to national service military training. Hey. First of all, this whole national service thing. I mean, I understand that, you know, you have to uh, pay service to your country. Mm -hmm. Fine. Yep. But now they're saying that what um, they wanted to include the whole military aspect. So making it mandatory for people who are uh, doing their national service to do six months of six military months. training. No, but what? apparently <laughs> it was supposed to be so. Yes, yes, yes. You know, yes. just two years into the implementation of the policy, mm -hmm. that military part was scrapped. Mm -hmm. But this current NSS secretariat, they want to enforce it. Mm -hmm. And they want to make sure that after your national service, one year, one year, one year now, and they will do her and they say ahoya 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 sa six months and they now salute to star hey sa san kwa hey sa and the best salute to hey i thank god that i'm done i can't look i can't do anything <laughs> Do anything. Military training. Even, even the press up alone. I can't do it. I'll cry. I'll cry. They'll beat me every day because I'll cry. Well, I, I, I don't know. But <laughs> if this thing should really happen, oh, it will be difficult. It will. It will. For me, I think it's a waste of time, frankly, and a waste of resources. I think that after school, you know, if people want to do an internship, they want to do their national service, okay, fine. I mean, I'm sure there are people who want to be in the military. Why don't you just, you know, exactly. pick them just up? Exactly, allow them to do it. I mean, I can't do... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Hey. Hey. Yes. I can't do that. Soldier to see. I'm tired. <laughs> yes, yes, this small thing you yeah. did. Yes. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so tell me, what's happening with women? You've seen the internet. internet. Oh, oh, yeah. Take a breath. Okay. okay. <laughs> so, according to um, some studies done by Opera, mm -hmm. uh, they conducted studies in Kenya, Nigeria, and South, South Africa. Africa. Mm -hmm. And the conclusion they came to is that women use the internet a lot more than men. You know, we like to go on Twitter and uh, go and research different novels and things like that. You know, we really find enjoyment and entertainment yep. 
in, in on the internet. So how can we help ourselves? We, we, I mean, <laughs> I think we women we like to just be on our phones because I remember you know when we go to parties, your bed dress here, I a party, and I say all to do is just be on our phones. Click, click, what's up? Unless we don't see something, we are just reading. Mm. Uh, we can't. Some guy will come talk to you, and, and you are just be, be on, on your, your phone. phone. <laughs> 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 I know, right? I, we can't help it. I mean, yes, women, we like have. to use the internet a we lot. Do. We do. And it's good for us. I mean, it's enlightening us. Yes, you're quiet. 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 <laughs> so, all right, guys, that's all we have for you guys today. I will see you another time. Bye. Ahoy. <laughs> You're squatting.